The things nobody tells you about buying your first home. Hey everyone, it's Peter Mancini here. Today I want to dive into something that has a lot of first time home buyers don't hear about until it's too late. I've talked to countless homeowners over the years and they all have one thing in common. They wish they'd known these six things before they bought their first home. You ready? Let's get into it. Because trust me, this advice could save you from serious headaches. We're talking about things you would always read in a listing or heard at an open house. It's the real stuff. The details that the Wall Street Journal, the New York Times, and the Real Deal often highlight when they're covering home ownership. First up, the true cost of owning a home is sneakier than you think. The mortgage payment, right? It's just the beginning. You've got property taxes, you've got homeowners insurance, You've got maintenance, and then, of course, the, sp the surprise repairs. Like when the ancient water heater gives out or your roof starts to leak. The New York Times offense reminds us that budgeting for homeownership means factoring in these hitting costs because they'll hit you when you least expect it. Next, let's talk about location. It's not just a real estate buzzword. It's everything. The charming house might seem perfect. But if the commute is brutal or the neighborhood doesn't vibe with your lifestyle, you might regret it later. The Wall Street Journal often emphasizes how crucial location is to long-term satisfaction and resale value. Don't just think about what's inside the home. Think about the community around it too. Third, the famous home inspections. Skimping here is like playing Russian roulette with your finances. A solid home inspection can reveal hidden issues that could cost you thousands of dollars down the road. The Real Deal points out a good inspector is worth every single penny. They'll find things that you might miss entirely, like structural issues, faulty wiring, or plumbing problems. Trust me, you'll be glad you hired them. The fourth one, your must-have list. It's definitely going to change. You might be obsessed with that big kitchen, but a year from now, you might wish you've gone for the extra bathroom or the bigger backyard. The New York Times has covered how first-time homeowners overlook these long-term needs. Think beyond your immediate desires and ask yourself, will this still fit my life five years from now? Number five, neighbors. They can make or break your home ownership experience. Bad neighbors, they can turn your dream home into a nightmare. Good ones, they're like hitting the jackpot. I always tell my clients, take time to chat with the neighbors before buying. According to the Redeal, having friendly, respectful community can add significant value to the home and your life. And finally, number six, sometimes walking away is the smartest move. Fear of missing out or FOMO is a real when you're house hunting. But if the property isn't right for you, don't let FOMO push you into a decision that you'll regret. As the Wall Street Journal points out, it's better to pass on a home that doesn't check most of your boxes than to settle and regret it later. So, there you have it. The six things most people wish they'd known before buying their first home. Trust me, knowing this stuff ahead of time can save you from a lot of if-only moments. You want to dig deeper and make, sure, and make sure you're prepared for your home buying process? Let's chat. Send me a message, drop a comment below, or give me a call. I'm here to help you find that home you love, not just today, but for years to come. No pressure, just honest advice. Thanks for watching, and I can't wait to help you start your home buying experience. Peter Mancini, Penn Realty, a signature experience.